Hello and good morning. Uh, Sunday morning. Um, it's a bit cold outside. I thought I'd just do a quick, um, a quick video on battery charging. Um, nothing too taxing for you today. Um, so keeping it brief, uh, I'm basically I've bought myself a lipo. Um, for the transmitter uh, it just means that i don't go through aa batteries having to get rid of those um you know they can pretty much do about two to three flights before it starts to get a bit low so i've invested in a uh 3c 3s sorry 200 2200 uh mah uh lipo as you can see here uh, and the idea behind that is um it just allows for continuous battery charging and to go longer with the transmitter. So just going to briefly go on how I deal and charge this. Long and short is this is how it comes. I've got these two here, uh, the balancing cable and then obviously the charging cable. Um, what it means is that this which is the official charging cable um, is now non-existent and is not needed um, so I've had to buy uh, one of these um, from eBay uh, it's a banana plug uh, XT60 um, and then that works by plugging in there so if I have a quick show you show plug that in like so then goes a balancing cable into the correct jack and then what we do is we connect that up it's a bit tight oh there we go okay and now we plug in the charger like so now for lipos it's recommended that you want to balance it so you want to balance it not charge it enter it's 220 or 2200 so we need to bring that down to that 2.2 and as you can see on the top it's 11.1 .1 volts so I want 11.1 .1 volts so if we hit then enter hold it down And it's asking me then to confirm it's happy with the battery, just get charge. So now, if we then go here onto the ink, you'll see up the top here three, there's three cells in there, and these are so they're pretty consistent at the moment 4.2, that's ticking over at 4.19 to 4.2, that's at 4.19 to 4.2. So to be fair, I mean, I haven't really used this much, so that's pretty well charged anyway. Um, and I don't want to keep charging it, just literally topping it back up. Um, but that's basically how really you should be dealing with your uh, transmitter LiPo. Um, and, and as I say, I, I prefer this better than the battery chargers. Uh, battery chargers? the batteries that um, that you can put in the transmitter and it's it's just so much more uh, convenient um, so that's it really um, that's a quick explanation of why and how to go about charging the transmitter battery um, with the Scout charger that comes with it the IMAX B6 um, and in this case this was uh, about 10 pound 
from eBay, uh, a Florian uh, LiPo uh, 3S, 11.1 volts, 2200 mAh. Um, and that's that for today. Um, any questions or anything, let me know. Um, I will be just going over a brief video for the Scout battery um, as well uh, later on. Have a good day.